everybody. So, Dama Wilson was in a restaurant yesterday, I believe, with her son and her family. And this woman told her that her son was annoying to shut him up. Mind you, Damo had came out in the past and said that her son was autistic, you know? So once Damo approached this woman and basically told her, you told me my son was annoying and you told me to shut him up, but I just want you to know that he's autistic. This woman acted like she had no care in the world, like so. Watch this disturbing clip that Damo posted and we'll get back to the rest of this video. I swear to God on my life. I swear to God on my life. I'm about to get up and go address this lady. I got my mask right here. Obviously, you don't have to wear a mask at a table. I'm about to go off. What you mean? Yo, like, I'm literally shaking. I've never had this happen to me in my life. Like, I just wanted to walk over and tell you that my son has autism. So for you to tell me that he's annoying and to shut him up is disrespectful. Well, you should be a nicer and ask, hey, is there a problem or something like that? But that's rude. I've okay. never had somebody ever in my life tell me something like that. Okay. Are you excuse me? Huh? I did. Thank you. What you mean I'm excused? As you can see, this woman had no remorse for Damo at all. You know, no remorse for Damo, no remorse for her son. You know, for Damo to walk back to this woman and say, you told me that my son was annoying and for me to shut him up. And I just want you to know that my son has autism. For this woman to be like, okay, and just kind of shoo her, so Damo wrote under the video, this is why I was so scared when Dominic first got diagnosed with autism. Like I always say, kids are cruel, but who would have thought an adult would have zero compassion? A grown bully spoke directly to him as if he could understand. My son is literally three and nonverbal for the most part, but he's resilient and he doesn't even realize what happened. And I thank God for that because if she would have hurt my baby's feelings or made him cry, I'm... NGL I would have blacked out he's still a happy kid and doesn't even know the pain I felt today from this situation he will always know how brilliant he is though and perfect I will always teach my son what makes him different makes him beautiful now to my royal family like could you imagine being in this situation where you're out with your kids and some whoever decides to fix their mouth and tell you that your child is annoying and when you go and you tell them that your child has some kind of disability or some type of mental health issue for them to just shoo you let's just say that i commend damo first and foremost before i even get into this i commend damo 100 percent because she really could have took it there now to whoever this lady is First of all, all I want to say is scary thinking that this woman can be somebody's teacher. She can be somebody's health provi provider, whatever, you know, and for her to be in a restaurant. Do you see how this woman had zero compassion when Damo said her son had autism? Like this woman really 100% genuinely did not care. She had, she did not care. It was almost like what I said still stands. You know, you still need to shut him up. He's still annoying. Like, that's just crazy. That's just crazy, you know? And I can only imagine of being a parent to an autistic child. You fear stuff like this. You fear how the world is going to treat your child because the world is already a cruel place as is. You know, people pick on people for like the, the craziest things. So... I can only imagine having a child that's autistic and just to think on what they're going to have to deal with in life and for to just think I'm going to a restaurant with my child. We're going to have a nice evening, not even thinking that you're going to run into someone with a dark heart like this, 
that has zero compassion for a child. First and foremost, to anyone that feels entitled to tell somebody about their damn kid in public, please don't. Please don't. It's no one's job to sit there and parent anyone's child, okay? There's no telling what Domo was doing, Dominic was doing, you know? But either way, this woman had no right to sit there and tell Domo to, one, shut her child up, and for two, to tell Domo that her child is annoying. Like, where do they do that at? So, like I said, I commend Domo because this woman, this woman, look... <laughs> I would have, I would have had to took it there, you know, and like I said, I commend Damo, but as to this woman, I have no idea who she is and I'm not telling nobody to find out who she is, but all I have to say is if you just so happen to run by this video, you just so happen to click on this video, I just want you to know that you are a disgrace. You are a disgrace. You are a peasant and I feel sorry for you because something has to be wrong with you for you to not be compassionate enough to you know put that ego aside you know because that was all ego what we saw when Dama wrote up on her or whatever like that she was too prideful to sit there and recant her words for she was too prideful to just say i'm sorry you know i'm sorry i had no idea that he was autistic i had no right to tell you anything about your child i'm so sorry she was too prideful you know like I said, man, um, if you just so happen to run by this video, I just want you to know that you are a disgrace and like, it's very unfortunate that it's people in this world with dark hearts like this, you know? Well, anyways, you guys, let me know what you think down below in the comments about this crazy, crazy situation and let me know what you would have done, you know, if this lady would have told you about your child also if you have a child that's um autistic i want to send my love to you you know i want to send my love to you i want you to know that you're strong i want you to know that your baby is perfect the way that they are don't mind the people in this crazy world because i promise you the problem is not with your baby the problem is with these dummies in this world and you trust, believe God sees all and your child is protected. Okay. So anyways, you guys, let me know what you think down below in the comments. All right. Peace.